Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix could not sign in. There was a problem connecting to the server when signing to iCloud account on iPhone and iPad. Solution 1 is soft reboot your iPhone and iPad. Go to settings. Next, find and tap on general. Now scroll down the screen to bottom and tap shutdown. Then turn off your device by dragging the slide to power off slider. Wait for a few seconds and turn on your device again. Solution 2 is enable and disable airplane mode. Launch settings app on your device. Now turn on airplane mode then wait for a minute. Next. Turn off airplane mode. Once you turned off, try to sign in. Solution 3 is Reset Network Settings. This process resets your connected Wi-Fi networks and passwords, APN and VPN settings and cellular settings. Go to Settings app. Scroll down the screen and tap on General. Next, tap on Reset at bottom. Here you have to select Reset Network Settings. Then it will be asked to enter your iPhone's passcode. In the pop up window, tap Reset Network Settings to confirm this process. Solution 4 is Turn on Settings under Cellular or Mobile Data. Launch Settings app. Now tap on Cellular or Mobile Data. Scroll down the screen and make sure that settings is turned on. If it's off, you have to turn on it. Solution 5 is make sure that date and time is correct. To do this, go to settings app. Now tap on general. Next, scroll down the screen and tap on date and time. Now turn on set automatically. If it's already turned on, then turn off and on it. Now try to log into iCloud. If again you get this error, then set date and time to manually. To do that, turn off set automatically. Tap on time zone. Here, select your country where you live, then set date and time. Next, restart your iPhone and try to log in. Solution 6 is turn off iCloud drive and turn on it. If you get this error when you are trying to log into the app store, then try this method. Go to settings app. Now tap on your name. Next tap on iCloud. Scroll down the screen and turn off iCloud drive. Then restart your device and turn on it again. Solution 7 is first restart your iPhone and iPad. If you are using iPhone 8 and later models, then do the following steps to first restart. First, quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, then do the following steps. Press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 6s Plus and earlier models then do the following steps. Press and hold the home button and sleep or wake button at the same time until you getting the Apple logo on your iPhone screen. Solution 8 is restore your iPhone and iPad as new. Open Finder or iTunes according to your macOS version, then connect your iPhone or iPad to Mac via USB cable. Now locate your device. This process wipe out your all data. If you didn't backup your device, take backup first. Then click on Restore iPhone or iPad. If you are signed in Find My, you need to sign out before you can click Restore. 
click restore in the pop-up window wait until the process is complete once done your mac will restart itself and set up your iphone or ipad as new thanks for watching do like share and subscribe to apple tech page